Welcome to another episode of our MWD Explained series. Today we're going to be talking about gamma radiation and gamma radiation sensors. Gamma radiation is radiation that is given off by radioactive isotopes like cesium, cobalt, uranium, potassium, and many others, and it's found all around us. Everywhere on Earth there is some level of background radiation from rocks and different materials that contain these radioactive isotopes. While drilling, we use gamma radiation of the well bore to identify the different types of rocks based on their radioactive properties. Gamma radiation kind of acts as sign markers or road signs down hole to tell us what formation or what part of the formation we're currently in. So we have here three gamma radiation sensors from various manufacturers. A gamma radiation sensor is composed of three main components, a sodium iodide crystal, a photomultiplier tube, and the electronics. Sodium iodide crystals have a unique property wherein when a gamma particle hits them, they emit photons. The photons are then picked up by the photomultiplier tube and converted to pulses on the gamma output line. So the way it operates is when a gamma particle hits it, photons are generated by the sodium iodide crystal. The photomultiplier tube picks up those photons and amplifies them such that they can be detected by the electronics and sent out to the rest of the MWD. The MWD system then transmits the total number of gamma counts per second back to surface. 